Channel 5 News in 60 is supported by Davis Law Firm. Hey folks, Michael Scott here with your news in 60 seconds. The El Paso Walmart shooter pleading not guilty to killing 22 people and injuring 26 others. Authorities say the shooter told them he was targeting Mexicans. At least 40 family members of victims were there for the court appearance. Texas state health officials confirming the first vape related death here in Texas. In North Texas, the victim is described as an older woman. That area has the highest number of vape related illnesses right now with 48, 21 in Southeast Texas. And right here in the Valley, the third highest cases at seven. The Gateway International Bridge is open to traffic. The bridge closed for nearly 15 hours on Thursday due to a protest on the Mexican side. Around 300 migrants sat in protests about their living conditions in Mexico and the U.S.-Mexico policies that keep them there. And your forecast for today, a cold front is coming, mostly cloudy and windy with a 50% chance of rain with highs and low 90s, but falling temperatures in the afternoon. And that's your News in 60. Have a great weekend. Channel 5 News in 60 is supported by Davis Law Firm.